So yesterday, NBA 2K17 soundtrack was released. There's a link to the soundtrack in the description. Now, ever since NBA 2K11, they have not made a soundtrack that, are, that I do not have to go through and take certain songs off. I don't know about you guys, but that's how it was for me in 2K11. In NBA 2K16, they had so many different songs, and I was able to play most of them. But after listening to this track for 2K17, it sounds so bad. I don't know about you guys. I've listened to at least 25 of the 40 songs, and I can only say that I'll be listening to like six songs the whole year. I think that 2K would be better off allowing the fans to create their own track. And instead of picking rappers and singers to pick the songs, why don't we just take a vote? We're the ones that have to listen to the music, not them. In NBA 2K, all of their game modes have my in it, so why does the soundtrack not have my in it? It should be my soundtrack. We have my career, we have my team, we have my GM, my league, everything is my. So why is it not my soundtrack? It's my player store, like, why? I don't understand that. Why is everything else my except my soundtrack? It's somebody else, it's some rapper, it's some singers. Yes, they might play the game, but they're not the only ones that have to play the game. So why don't they just have a vote and let the fans pick it? Everybody gets a chance to pick the songs. Or why don't you just let us create our own soundtrack, 2K? I don't understand what's so hard about that. 2K, just because you pick somebody like Jay-Z does not mean, just because he can rap, does not mean that he can pick good music, because clearly he cannot. Last year when they had the three DJs, they, put, they picked good music. In 2K11... That was good music. You didn't have somebody picking those songs. But as soon as you bring in Jay-Z and you want to bring in these other shitty... At he's not a shitty rapper, but he's a shitty song picker. He doesn't know how to pick good songs. I don't understand that. How can you be such a good writer and a good rapper, but you cannot pick a good song for a video game? It doesn't make any sense. It's like he just did it for the money, which he probably did. He probably did it because he likes these songs, but he didn't really care about the fans. The soundtrack from NBA 2K15 was so bad, I played three songs the whole time. When 2K16 came out, they had to bring back classic songs from NBA 2K11 because they were better than the songs that were brought out today. And maybe that's because rappers and singers, they just don't make as good of songs now that they did back in 2K11. I don't understand why they brought this horrible ass song called creator back i don't know if you guys know what i'm talking about but that song creator was on 2k15 i hated i could not listen to it anymore and they brought it back 2k why why did you bring that fucking song back chris move asked in his video about the soundtrack does the soundtrack change the game and my answer is yes move it does i can't play a game with bad music playing you feel me if you're playing a game and you don't enjoy the music how are you going to enjoy the game if all you're doing is deleting the songs and I want to be able to listen to songs while I'm playing the game. And I don't want to have to get rid of every single song and play the same songs over and over. Yes, you can use the flash drive on the PlayStation. But every time you want to change the song that every time that you want to change the song, you have to exit your screen and it takes you and suspends your like application. And then it takes you back into it. And if you were online or something, you won't be on online anymore. And that's stupid to me. So what I'm going to do for 2K and what I'm going to do for you guys is in my next video, I'm going to make a video about what I think the soundtrack for NBA 2K17 should have been. And maybe, just maybe 2K sees this. Make sure you tweet it at them. Maybe they'll see it. Maybe they won't. Hopefully they do. Maybe they'll put some of these songs in here. And I get it, 2K. You have to get the licenses for all these songs. So maybe you cannot get them. But these are the types of songs that should be in the game. And I understand we need a variety. So I'm going to have a, a variety in there. I'm going to pick like 20 songs. And you guys let me know how you feel about them in the comment section down below. And let me know how you guys feel about this soundtrack for NBA 2K17 down below. Make sure you guys drop a like if you enjoy. Subscribe if you're new. And it's your boy Ty signing out. Peace. With the release of NBA 2K17 fast approaching, I want to share my predictions and my wishes of what the My Career Mode might be all about. Now, I could go insane and say some things that are just unrealistic. Let's just be real.